discharge of my official duty. For the discharge of my official duty. Or as may be specially permitted by law. Or as may be specially permitted by law. So help me God. So help me God. This is the second time since assuming by the grace of God and the generosity of the Ghanaian people the high office of President of the Republic that I have the honor of presenting credentials to persons appointed in accordance with Article 74 Clause 1 of the Constitution to safeguard and promote the image and interests of our nation outside these shores. The 22 men and women who will receive their letters of credence this evening have been carefully chosen to become our ambassadors and high commissioners. They have distinguished themselves in their various fields of endeavor, politics, medicine, law, academia, chieftaincy, military, business, diplomacy, social work, and in the public service of our country. They are eminently fit to represent Ghana in their respective places of accreditation, which have indeed expressed satisfaction at their appointments. I congratulate each one of you warmly on your well-deserved appointment. Ambassadors and High Commissioners, your roles are threefold diplomatic, ceremonial, and administrative. You must, however, bear in mind that in all of these, you have the onerous responsibility of preserving and promoting the image of a country whose reputation amongst the Committee of Nations is high. You represent a country that as a result of the commendable conduct of the Ghanaian people, is regarded as one of the most stable on the continent, which is a functioning democracy governed by the rule of law and respect for individual liberties, human rights, and the principles of democratic accountability. You are the most visible symbol of our country out there, and in all your actions, you must guard jealously our country's image. I'm confident that this is a charge you will uphold. This means that you have the responsibility to drive private sector investment into Ghana. You are the chief promoters of Ghana's commercial interests to the respective countries to which you are going. Promoting Ghana means working closely with our ministries and agencies at home, whose role it is to generate investment in the country.